who am I? I perceive the objects of this world. I am aware of them, but they are not aware of I. I perceive the sensations that seem to define this body, including the sensations of my head and my face. I am aware of them. They are not aware of I. Who am I? Who is the I that is aware even of all of these sensations? And one by one we go through all of our experiences in this way. I am aware of the thoughts. They come and go. When a thought is present, I am aware of the thought. When the thought is absent, I am aware of no mind. Therefore, neither mind nor no mind am I. Who am I? Whatever emotions, sensations might exist here, I am aware of them. They are not aware of I. Who is this I? that is aware of all of this phenomenal existence. Even the sense of existence, the sense of being, my own presence, I am. I is aware of this I am. But even this I amness, this being, is not aware of I. Who is this I? I see that as being is here and being is present then the play of this world is present and all of this appearance called life is present. But I am aware even of my sleep where nothing is Like the body, the outside appearances, feelings, thoughts, emotions, imagination, memory, 
all of this is not. Even the sense that I exist dissolves. Yet I remain as what? I am aware even of nothing, whether it is nothing or something, the awareness remains unchanged, untouched. Where is this I in relation to this awareness? I see that I am no thing. There is no separation between awareness and I. Therefore, this awareness I am, prior even to the sense I am, unchanging, unmoving, unconcerned, with no attributes, no labels. All that comes and goes, comes and goes within me. Within the I that is spaceless, all space is born. Within the I that is timeless, all time seems to appear. I am that, I am this, I 